All right, uh, we have a change of plan on the camera here. I was going to make these uh, these uh, support bars up on each side of the camera, and then uh, the other side would have pushed the cartridge back towards the back of the uh, the back plate here. Now I'm looking uh, looking into this a little bit further. The cartridge actually needs a lot of work to try and make that light proof and uh, I've decided to actually push the cartridge towards the front and not the back. Alright, so um, if I push it towards the front I've got a better chance of actually sealing inside here and stop any light leaks coming in from the side here. If I push towards the back here I'm going to be in a lot of trouble trying to um, stop any light leaks in the side there. So, a little bit of change of plan but not to worry. Um, it's uh, all done. Um, that was a uh, video that you guys will never see <laughs> and uh, anyway we're going to move on with the rest of the build uh, so what I've done here is actually made the same material as this the same MDF uh, thickness here which I think is around about 3 mil. this uh, MDF 3 mil. you can buy that in the hardware I've cut another piece to fit inside sitting in the, the bottom of the camera here and right on the edge here I've got a chamfer I'll just show you that. I've just got a slight chamfer coming along the bottom here. Uh, now what happens is, what I'll be doing actually is gluing that plate to the back there. And when we put the cartridge in now, it's going to sit nice and snug there. When it gets to the end of that cartridge, of course, this ridge is going to lift up the cartridge and lock it in up against the camera there. So we're going to have a an uplift on the... Um, on the ridge here and into the camera. So when we glue that in. Uh, now, so inside here I'm going to uh, put the guides here to stop any light leaks plus across the front end here we'll be putting some of this uh, rubber mat that I've got here. Now this stuff you can get basically anywhere. This is just off an old mouse mat. So if you find a mouse mat fairly thickish, uh, this rubber is quite hard in compounds so it's perfect for this job. So what we're going to be doing later is to cut a strip across there and put that across that uh, entrance part there and then we're going to be gluing the guides in here to um, make all the inside there light proof. So that's it so far. So when you, uh, when you cut this piece out make sure you slowly chamfer this with, the, with your block and sandpaper and try it every couple of seconds just to make sure that that cartridge is going to fit just in there and clip inside the camera. Of course if you do it too much it's just going to slide in out and uh, it'll be too too sloppy. So make sure you do it a little bit gradual at a time and then fit it in. Once it fits in that's it. Glue the back in and then we're ready for the next step. Those guys inside the camera.